I've been waiting all day for some of Wolfgang Puck's amazing drumsticks, his fried chicken, some of his culinary french fries. Well, this is our Wolfgang Puck Bistro 1800 watt, three liter, cool touch deep fryer. We have learned that deep fryers are even more popular in the summertime. This is the first presentation of the day because it's our showstopper. And a showstopper is really our own personal show's mini today special. They're $99.95. They're free shipping just for this show. And one of the things that make it special, because we've been talking about the uh, reason what makes a showstopper a showstopper, mm -hmm. four flex payments, this show, it's, and until it, the quantities are gone. It stops the show. That's it. Stop. It's gonna, then we'll stop the show. There are okay, 2,000 no, uh, 2, or so to go around. Okay. So they're $24.99 well, a month. Now, how, what's, why do you need a fryer like this? Well, I think okay. everybody needs a fryer because everybody loves fried food. Everybody does fried food. If right. you're Japanese, if you're American, if you're whatever, you're... <laughs> they're your tongs. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Silly tongs. So, look at that. Like I love it. You it. almost got mad at your own kitchen I tool. know. No, it's not mine. This one is not mine. That's oh, the way. I don't that's know where your... we found it. Oh, that's funny. That's not yours. Yeah. <laughs> that's not. Okay, so you're welcome to throw this one, too, if it doesn't open. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Excellent. Is that hot here? Is that hot here, Marianne? Yeah. Okay, all right. So... Now, look at that. Oh, onion rings. If you just buy that to make onion rings once a week, if you make them at home, your oil will be too hot, your oil will be too cold. You will never get it right because you need a thermometer and you need it to the right temperature. Now look at that here. So you just dust them in flour. That's the, I put them in a little bit of buttermilk before, oh, just buttermilk. like you would do with the chicken. Oh, okay. So you, you just dip them in, put them in a, yeah, and, and flour. That's and it? And flour. And then you put them in, I think, to get off the excess flour. You can see that. Look at that. See, you don't want that in your fryer. Okay. It bites. <laughs> ha! <laughs> Crazy. Let's go over and we want to explain why you should have Wolf's fryers. Okay. Let's go through the parts over here because I know that okay, you made this. show them the whole thing. You want to do? Okay. Well, see, here, first yeah? of all, now, Marion, I know that the coil, the heating element, you'll see it's separate. And this is really important because it's detachable, but it's immersed in the oil. But there's a lot of reasons why that's important, correct? And it's also modeled after exactly what's used in the restaurants for the really big fryers. Okay. Just made small for home. And that's really important because the most important thing when you're frying is to keep that oil at the proper temperature. And so when you, when you do, the exterior is really, really crispy. The interior of your food is juicy or fluffy, depending so on what wait, the food is. So wait, this is how easy it is to disassemble. Absolutely. And then yeah. This goes, you could take out, like this is what I love about it. Do you see how it's got like a little... Uh, the Re recessed indented area. recessed reservoir at the bottom so all the queer this way all the crumbs will fall to the bottom and you won't have them attached to food and then they're below the heating element so they don't burn as much which is what also ruins your oil See, and look, makes it taste so, bad is that smart mm -hmm. i never knew there was so much technology in a deep fryer and there's your basket Ooh. which is removable and it also folds inside for storage look. your cord is always break away on a fryer for safety because you god forbid someone should bump it you want the cord to come away not the fryer to come off of the counter beautiful and i love this because it's the kind of lid that you can look through it also has a filter so the smells stay inside if you use it closed, but it's also detachable. And with this one, because it has the lever to lower and raise, uh -huh. you can load your food in the basket, close the lid, and then lower the that? food so no chance of splashing and the odors Supposedly. stay inside, which is really great. I love this small one. And you know, Bill, the timer, which is really important because something like french fries only take about two minutes. Oh, yeah? The timer is detachable. You can pull it out oh, how and cool. take it with you. And then this is one of my other favorite things to have. If you have a dog or a cat, or young children, it has a magnetic detachable plug so that if anybody walks by, instead of when they pulled the plug, it would pull the oil over, mm -hmm. it detaches the plug. You see that? It's called a, break a breakaway plug. So it's like, boom, that's it. So anyway, those are the features, but let's get back to cooking. This is really gonna be one of your favorite things for the Absolutely. summer. Absolutely, now we are cooking here. So here, we have our chicken finger for the kids in here. You can see they're not done yet. Okay. Look at that. Oh, your, your, your onion rings done yet? Yeah, my onion rings are almost done. Okay. One minute away. Oh, the french fries are done the, These are sweet potato fries. Oh, look. Look at that. Let's see. Yeah. I have one more minute. Can I cheat and taste yeah, one? Yeah, I know for sure. Okay, well, that's let's, cool off. Let it, let it do one more minute. Okay. And this they is have to be crispy in the outside. Now, flash frying is healthier for you than, yeah. than really, we're calling well, it a deep fryer, but it's flash frying, isn't well, it? Well, it's, it's frying, frying is frying really, but not the way you think out there. If you have a fryer with not the right temperature, you cannot fry. So it's really important to have a 
thermostat to have it controlled, so that way you know how hot you're gonna fry it. Ooh, look, homemade donuts. Now, see, yeah. unless you have a deep fryer, you really don't have a reservoir deep enough for oil that's scalding hot to do a, 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 a what do you call it, a donut like this. A donut, a cheater donut, donut, we call them. Well, actually, it's not. It's the kind where you buy this kind of biscuit in, in your grocery store. Uh -huh. And you know what? It's not homemade, but I don't care. It's really easy, and if you want a donut really quickly, this is what you do. Buy these. So that's that pop-out dough. Yeah, poke the little hole, give oh, it a twirl it. to make that. And then you just throw it in there? And it makes a surprisingly good donut. Look at that. That's how you made that donut? Absolutely. I thought you rolled yeah. out dough. Two minutes, and they're done. Wow. And, and they're really can, good. And they All right, now I'm taking my stuff out. I'm taking the fries out, the onions out. I always season them with a little salt and pepper first. The, the sweet potato fry, you can add a little sugar, a little bit of uh, cinnamon to it, and it's really perfect. Now look at this, guys. Oh, look at these onion rings. You remember when you go into the steakhouses yeah. and they give you these you, on the side? Wolves are better. Uh, well, they're, they're they're never, better they're because my, I, they never come out this way in my house, I'll tell yeah. you that. Well, even in most of the steakhouses, you won't get it that perfectly. Even for Ooh. us in the restaurant, it is hard. It's Cut Steakhouse, which is Lish. the most famous one. It's hard <laughs> to do them like that. Now, this is three liters. So how many chicken pieces do you think you could fry at one time in this? This Let's is our a smaller fryer. Smaller? Yeah. But maybe six. Six pieces? Six nice pieces. That's nice, though. That's two people eating just like that. Now, and look then, at that. Oh, look at these sweet potato fries. You know we what? Have You're going to love this for, fries. Oh, for Here we have our chicken fingers. Yeah. My kids love them. Each time when we go to Spago, they want this fried chicken fingers. Now mm. look how many. Two, four, six, seven in here. Mmm. Sweet potato fries. Unbelievable. Yeah. It's delicious. Now, if you want to make them poorer, for example, right. put your shrimps in the batter and, and just drop them in the drop meat. them in your fryer. You know what, let's go to the phones and say hello to Paul in Florida, who has a testimonial on your deep fryer. This is our showstopper, Paul. How you what, doing, fellas? We're good. What do you think about that free shipping today? Oh, man, I'll tell you what. I wish we... We got that the last time and we ordered this here. Yeah? And what deep do you, fryer, and my wife has put about eight different items in there. Uh, Onion yeah. rings, potatoes, you name it. Yeah. And we've got uh, another... I forget the other one. We ordered that utensils you had today, the kitchen tools. Uh -huh. Oh, the show... Yeah, we the Today Special. That. And I was waiting online to talk to you to thank Wolfgang for his ingenuity on all this products. Because uh, let me tell you, it saves my wife a whole lot of work in the kitchen. Thank That's you. That's so nice. And I'll tell you what, if uh, no matter what you have, she just loves it. She, in fact, I think she loves you, and I'm glad you're there and she's here. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, <laughs> Paul, I cannot you... afford another wife. Don't worry, Paul. <laughs> That's funny. How, how does the, the food preparation come out of your deep fryer when you use it? Oh, man, it just comes out. She, she tried the fries, first of all, and they were just a little too long in there, so the next batch she put in right. cut down on the minutes of it, and those, the French fries, the onion rings, and the potatoes yeah. were just out of this world. That's great. You could also use it to make deep fried ice cream, Paul. Thank you so much for being part of the show. We'll ask well, Wolf how to do that. Thank uh, you guys very much, and thank, thank you. you. Bye, Paul. Pleasure. Bye, Paul. Listen, this is our big showstopper. We waited till just this few last few minutes to launch it. Wolf and Marion are doing everything from donuts. You can do pastries. You can do deep fried ice cream. Uh -huh. You can do chicken wings. You can do a little mini. If you want to do corn dogs, oh my gosh. I'll tell you, there's a great recipe for corn dogs. Or fried green cheese or fried uh, Oh, green fried cheese, cheese sticks. Look Do at we that. have those yeah, to prepare? You have leftover cheese. Come on here. Okay. Get a close up here. Yeah. Look at that. You serve it with salad with a little tomato sauce. Look at that. See that? Mm. Yum. Those are beautiful. Now, you can put a little tomato sauce underneath. You mm. can put a little salad with it. Oh, look at that. The list. Look at that cheese. Would you look yeah. at that molten cheese? Oh my God. Look at these chicken fingers. Yeah. Mmm. These are delicious. Look at that. So that could be any cheese you like, Brie cheese or Swiss I mean, cheese. This is not greasy. No. See, look, look, let me show you something. And I just took this piece of chicken. I'm going to snap it open. Do you see the small piece? Yeah. Do you see how the inside is nice and moist and tender and the outside is crispy? But it's not like oozing with grease. And that's why I love it. Mmm. Oh, look at that tempura shrimp. Tempura shrimp. Unreal. Mmm. And everything is easy to clean, right? Absolutely. If not, we would not be here. So, listen, this is the way it works. When, you, when you're when you done frying, you can actually take the oil, let it cool, 
and I'll turn this around and show you. The vessel comes out that holds and houses the oil. And then if you want to, you just take the um, heating element out like this. You see this slips right out. Make sure it's cool when you do this, obviously. There's two handles. There's the drum. And you can even strain the oil and then reuse it if you'd like to. And then remember, it's got that recessed reservoir so all the crumbs and all the crust falls to the bottom so that you don't cook it to the food that yeah. you're preparing. Thermostat lets you set it and forget it. And then it also even has a filter, which I love. And the filter is nice, and the filter, I meant the, yeah, the air filter on top, and that way, you know what, when you are cooking, and I'll tilt it up so you can see, this way when you are preparing food, you're not gonna smell the whole house up. Now, of course, when you open it up, there's gonna be some odor, but then you look, this is the other thing. You know when you go into the restaurant and they push that little electronic button and the fries just kind of automatically go down? Well, this is manual, but look, you just take your thumb, you slide it forward, and then when you push it downward like this, it drops the basket into the oil so that you're not standing face over it, dropping it down. We're gonna keep cooking. All we right. wanna hear from you. Okay, now what are these? Ah, uh, this is um, uh, Adam's special balls, uh, cheese balls with olives in the middle. And cheese balls with yeah, olives with inside. With a wasabi crust. Oh my gosh, am I gonna be having a blast tonight with all yeah. this food? <laughs> okay, now here's the thing. We brought in about 2,000, what, 300 of these. Yeah. For the, for the night. Now, th this is Wolf's second to the last presentation. He's here tomorrow as well. But this is 150912. If you call now, you'll be able to lock in the uh, $10.96 savings on shipping. Free shipping. Four flex payments, it'll only cost you $24.99 a month. And every time Wolf comes to HSN, <coughs> excuse me, with his deep fryer, they sell out. Now, what are you doing over here? These are cherry fried pies. So some pie dough, add some cherries to it, mm -hmm. fry them. You can glaze them or just put some cinnamon sugar or powdered sugar on them. Uh -huh. And they're crispy and delicious, and they take two minutes to cook. Mmm. So really, you, I mean, any kind of culinary thing that you want to do. You want to do Mexican food, you could do Mexican. No. You can do real good old, you know, fashion American hot wings with a hot sauce. Well, let's say hello to Rich, who's calling in from Grand Rapids, Michigan, who has a testimonial on this deep fryer. Hey, Rich, welcome to HSN. Well, my testimonial is on the bigger one that he had before. I oh, love good. it. Oh, good. What do you love about it? <laughs> greasy. But my biggest question is, how did he get those onion rings so small? So tall? How did he cut them? So small. Oh, I just oh. Cu I cut them with the mandolin. So the, the mandolin. A mm -hmm. mandolin. Okay, that's the one that's in that kit I bought today, then. No. No? No, a mandolin is a very sharp device that we don't have in the show today, but... Oh, okay. you know, Oh, we have one on hsn.com. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're, they're wonderful. Yeah. yeah, and you know what? It makes them paper thin mm -hmm. to where you... They're like... Sh they're called shoestring onion rings. Yeah. But the food comes out so excellent there, you know, like a lot of these deep fryers I used to have. Right. Take a bite and, oh, it's greasy. Yeah. And it's, I like where you can just drain the oil and it, you can reuse it again and the crumbs stay out, you know. You did a fantastic job with your deep fryers. I really love them and keep up the great work. I love today's special value. Ah. Like they always say, where's this, where's that? Hey, it's all in that kit now. You don't have to look for it no more. I know, I hate digging through the kitchen tool drawer, yeah. Rich, you're right. What Rich has been talking about, and I'm gonna show this to everybody who doesn't know because there's only one presentation left tonight with Shannon. This is our today's special. It's a set of 11 garnishing tools. Very quickly, it comes in black, it comes in red. You get all of this, almost 92,000 sold today. Black only, the red sold out, I warned you. But here's the thing. You buy one, it's $19.95. You buy two, you save $5 off the price. It's then $35 plus tax and shipping for two. I ordered two red before the show, and all these tools you're gonna order. Call to order the fryer and just tack on to it the garnishing set. Oh, you could do things that you can deep fry with this, right? Now, yeah. what about, can the butter curler be used to curl other things, vegetables? Well, you can do with our thing here, you can... <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'll talk to you the for a while, curler, don't you? Mm -hmm. No, I use so it on like, the watermelon boats. Oh, I'll use it oh, a lot. Oh, the watermelon. Oh, yeah. yeah, for the scallops. Or you can use it for, like, if you want to julienne or make, like, potato sticks. Yeah. You fried can. potato sticks, exactly. you're gonna love it. So this is our tool chest uh, from Wolfgang Puck for $20, $19.95. And then there's like a little place, a home for each cooking or each rather garnish utensil. And it matches the apron that I'm wearing. Ask our sales representatives about the apron. And Dan, if you'd be so kind to give me the item number for the apron set, we'll tell our customers about that because I'm wearing the grayish black and then it comes in red as well. 
is that or is that not a jewel to have all your tools in one little, if you will, tool chest for the kitchen? Now, what's over here now? These are hush puppies oh, to go with the fried gosh. chicken that Wolf is meeting. Yeah. I have been at that so here. You know, my son Alexander. <clears throat> He is so difficult, and he eats Wiener Schnitzel he could eat every day. So I have to fry it for him, but I know in a good fryer, it's not bad for him. You know, if you have bad oil, it would be terrible. I would never give it to him, but I can fry in this fryer perfectly crispy schnitzels. Like, look like this one here. Can you see that? And Wiener wow. Schnitzel is a very thin piece of chicken that's breaded, and then it's put into a Chicken, veal, or pork we use. Or pork. And then what do you put on top? Anything, or just leave it eat plain? Lemon. Just lemon. You squeeze lemon. It's dry. It's crisp. You, the it's inside, juicy. The inside. It's a perfect cutlet. You know, in Italy they call it Ville Milanese. Oh yes. And they put a salad on top with arugula and cherry tomatoes, which is delicious. Delicious. Stuff. You know what? This is your day, and the deep fryer. I will tell you, if you look through this whole table of goodies. Starting at the very end there, look at that fried chicken. Do you have a really famous like family recipe of fried chicken, but it never comes out crispy because you don't have a deep fryer? That's why you need a deep fryer. Have you ever tried to make some of the other culinary gourmet items, like Wiener Schnitzel, which is a, a Swiss dish? So, uh, Austrian, excuse me. Those men. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Boy, you almost threw a piece of chicken at me. <laughs> Don't do it. I'll put you in okay. the fryer next time you say something. I'm going to cook you. Will, you will remember me for a long time. Look at this fried cheese. Oh, the fried peppers look, here. Look, look at, at that. This. Did we stuff them? Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Yes. When, you, when can you do this at home in a frying pan? Stuff poblanos. Oh, this is uh -huh. unbelievable. Now, look at the chili poblanos here. Mm. I won't have oh, look, to go. Look how crispy it is. You can hear it. Wow. Yum. Mmm. That chicken is look at so that. good. See that? With a little case of fresco okay, in here. That is a meal. Yeah. Ah, oh, or an appetizer. Yeah. You well, know what? Now, what you about... You serve that with a little tomato sauce or a little spicy salsa and you're done. Can you deep fry stuffed peppers, like stuff with meat? But it would take a long time to cook. Yeah. Yeah. If yeah. you cook the meat before, yeah. you have oh. to have cooked meat before, then you can do it, obviously. <coughs> so cook the meat before, stuff the peppers, throw them in there, uh -huh. bread it or something, and let them just fry. Listen, fried vegetables, unbelievable. Yeah, tempura vegetables, tempura shrimp you saw me making. Delicious. These, uh, look at these chicken fingers, they're unbelievable. You'll great never taste for this. little appetizers. Look at, look at this one here, the cheese. Cheese balls with mm. olives in the middle. So you can serve them in small or in big version, the way you like it and use some crumbs around. Listen, free shipping only while this supply...